guys, I'm here today to do a review of Bonfire by Kristen Ritter. This book comes out November 7th. I was able to get this book at New at BookCon and I was actually able to meet her and get it signed and she was a lovely in person. Um, and I was really, really happy to get to meet her and I really did enjoy the book. I gave it three and a half stars. Um, if you did not get to meet her and like be in the same room with her, I would maybe say maybe I would consider this a borrow. Um, because I felt like the novel was really interesting. I don't think I would read it again. If she does the audiobook, maybe I would re-listen re to it because she's telling me the story. But overall, I really liked it. I like, I always like stories about characters who go back to their past and try to unsolve a mystery. And I really did like, um, the corruption and the way the story was told. Like, um, you know, there was like a illness there was like corruption there was like pollution and stuff like that I really did like I do think as I've said this before I'm not always the biggest fan of unlikable characters but I do get what Kristen Ritter was trying to do so I do admit that the character of Abby did grow on me and that was okay with me I did think that the pacing of the novel was a little bit clunky at points it wasn't the cleanest pacing I've ever read in a mystery novel um, there was also a kind of a massive info dump towards the end of it, but again, that's kind of just the genre and you have to just kind of get used to that. But I definitely did like elements of the story and I thought that it was really, I definitely like how they dealt with rape culture in this book because I thought it was super realistic to someone who just graduated high school a couple of years ago and I think that Kristen Ritter hit that really good. And I really did like her writing style. It was really hard for me to not, not to see Jessica Jones or like a character she would play whenever I thought read I whenever I read Abby I saw her which isn't a bad thing because she kind of plays characters like that a lot um so that was okay for me but just going to that maybe try not to do that I know it's kind of hard but I overall really loved it I don't read I don't read a lot of adult bo adult books very often so it was like a nice departure from me as well um but I would definitely like to read other books by her I would love to see her take on different issues but I really do like her as a mystery writer because I did not see the ending coming and I did not predict it. The ending I felt was a little bit rushed as well and that's just kind of sometimes what happens when you when you're doing a first novel you just want to rush the end and I felt like that was the case in this book as well but I really did enjoy it and I highly recommend that you check it out. Um, you may want to get check it out from your library or maybe even get it on your kindle but this book is not going anywhere because it's assigned to me. Um, was assigned in general um but overall I really enjoyed it and highly recommend you check it out it comes out November 7th um and I recommend you give it a try um but I hope you guys are having a great day and I'll talk to you